One way to make your chatbot smarter is to upload a knowledge source. So give it some source of information to pull from and answer questions from. So real quick, I'm gonna show you how to do that. In a chatbot that you've created, all you need to do is go to instructions and then you'll see the place for uploading a knowledge source. So you can upload a file that can be a CSV, a doc, a text file, and then you can also connect it to Zapier tables. Here's what you need to know. Chatbots looks at rows of data to know that the data is all related to each other. And then in an unstructured format, it looks at paragraphs. So rows and paragraphs, depending on what you want to choose, that's how you need to think about them. So if I upload a file, maybe an FAQ document for this chatbot, I click file and then look for that file to upload. The chatbot will look at each of these paragraphs and know that that is related. So you'd have the question, just below it, you're gonna have the answer. By hitting enter twice, you're telling the chatbot that these are separate questions. So when I choose that FAQ, it will upload as a knowledge source for this chatbot. I can give it a quick description and click add source. Now the other thing I can do, like I mentioned, is connect a Zapier table to the chatbot as a knowledge source. I can simply add that source as well. I'll click table, choose the right table, and click add source. Here's what that Zapier table looks like. We got questions, answers, and a category. Again, chatbots looks at each row to know that they are all related. When I go back into the chatbot, I can ask it one of the questions in the list. It's gonna go retrieve it from the knowledge source and pull it in. Now let's say a user asks a question that's just not in your knowledge source. What happens then? You have two options. You can have AI generate an answer. Maybe you trust the AI enough to do that. Go for it. If you don't, then you can choose to display a custom response. All you do is go to the settings here in instructions, choose show a custom message, and enter in what you want the chatbot to say when it doesn't know the answer. And there you have it. That is one way you can make your chatbot even more powerful, customized to your business.